Haha, <laughs> yes, yes, people, we're back in the house again. Peace, one love to each and every single one of you. Yes, Good yes. Good morning. Morning, morning to everybody out there. I hope you are well on this great fine day. Yes, yes. Cheers, people. So, um, we'll talk about the peasant in a minute. Yeah, we will get to the to obviously uh, the the deleted stream of his. We're going to talk about that, like I said, we would. Um, first of all, just a little bit of an overview of how things have been going on. I mean, obviously, we decided to restrict the live streams, uh, the nighttime live streams, basically to 18 plus, um, because we were getting a lot of sort of issues in there, weren't we? And it was yeah. just like uh, it was probably just too much to sort of deal with, really, and was making it not fun. Not just not fun for us, but not fun for um, you know the genuine people who were coming in there who were getting ruined by sort of trolls and things like that. So we did the 18 plus um, last night, as you know, just to see how it sort of went, and it just went really smooth, really smooth. And for the couple of quid that we obviously make um, on the ads, on the ad revenue for monetization. Um, it just it ain't worth it to us really like I said it ain't about the money we don't you know we're not money grabbing it's about giving the right um, sort of impressions on the channel giving the right information on the channel giving the right do you know what I mean just being a good channel all around basically and that's what we always wanted to be to be fair don't get me wrong making money is great but for the little that we are making at the minute with the amount of subscribers we've got it ain't worth it, it ain't worth the hassle so to me, I would say that's a win. That's a win situation. So um, that's the way we're always going to do it from now on. You know, the the Friday night lives, the the the, the, the night street, the, you know, the live streams when we're like having a drink and things like that. They've got to be 18 plus. <coughs> They've got to be 18 plus, and that proves last night that it absolutely worked 100% the right way. So we'll continue. The live streams will be. Like I say, the nighttime live streams I'll say will be like that. We don't really do any gaming streams now, anyway, really, do we? So occasionally. We have one occasionally. Yeah. So. We'll probably do more of those during the winter months when yeah. we can't get out. And exactly. Do stuff. Exactly. That'll be a more winter thing. So we'll worry about the, the gaming streams when we come to it. But for the minute, like I say, we're going to continue with that. We think it was the right decision. And yeah, so apologies to anyone who, you know, it does get offended by that and who'd like to join. But it's too risky for us. And we can't be saying... Um, can't be saying one thing and, and then doing yeah. the same. Yeah, and he, he's right there, to be fair. He's got a point there, you know. And um, I can't sort of, you know, say one thing and then expect him to do another. You've got to practice what you preach. At the end of the day, it was never my uh, um, idea to get a younger audience in anyway from the things that we were doing. It was always an old, older audience. And like I said, we never really... We never had any youngins in, no. ever, ever have we had any young people in up to the point I was making these videos a few weeks back and then obviously it has changed so but yeah it's, it's, it's all about adults having conversations yeah. isn't it some people might have kids like we do yeah you know and it's nice to talk to other adults and it, and it stops other adults from speaking if they think that the kid there's kids in there you know but I've got to say all all the trouble pretty much stopped the yeah. the trolling was down to a minimum um, I know that obviously um, the peasant has um, people in my live streams. I know that he's in my live stream under fake accounts as well. Um, I know that they're also donating through the PayPal. So it's just silly, isn't it? Really, do you know what I mean? Silly. What 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 is that going to achieve by donating to the channel? You know, thank you very much for all that. You know, thank you. But you don't need to donate to the channel. Yeah, that's your way of saying, oh, I've got eyes on you. I'm there. Well, it makes no difference. It's free. Anyone can come in and watch it. You can come in and watch it. If you want to come in and talk, you're not banned. You're not blocked. Yeah? I haven't blocked you. Yeah? It's freedom of speech at the end of the day to a degree of, you know what I mean? You know, when people are getting out of hand, obviously, then it gets cut off. But, you know, pretty much people can come in and have their opinion. Just not in an aggressive, swearing, um, racist, vicious manner or anything like that. That's, that's what gets blocked on our channel. People don't get blocked for having an opinion. It's just how you put it across. <coughs> but the channel was at risk, basically, um, by not restricting it. 
and he was um, going to try and do whatever he could at that point. So for me, like I say, I haven't got to hang on to them younger audience like he has. Yeah, he won't age restrict his his lives. Yeah, he will not age restrict his lives. I will tell you that now. Yeah, All right. Because when you age restrict the lives, you lose all of the monetization not just the advertisements you also lose the super chat buttons at the bottom right as we discovered last night but it didn't bother us did it we just stick a paypal link up and then again we get a you know one genuine person thank you so much who gives us a donation thank you for that and then we get you know another one which is quite clearly with the name i'm not even going to say but the name of the associate should we say yeah we're, your boyfriend, the one who pays for the flat, yeah? His name was the donation name, yeah? We'll call him Stephen, shall we? So, but it's funny that that name was coming up the other night, and then, ooh, yeah. So, yeah, we know you're in the chat. Like I say, you're quite, you're quite welcome to come in the chat and have a chat, but just don't come in and fake accounts. Don't get other people to donate and try and do things like that. Because what's the point? I'm not going to do it to you. I'm not in your chat. I've not got people in your chat. Because I just, I'm not like that. I've got no reason to, you know. And again, that's implementing me in something which I just wouldn't want to get implemented in. It's one thing that I can make a legal video and just talk, yeah. But when you get to that stage of getting other people involved and trolling for you, you're looking at criminal um, sort of... Um, implications at that point and it's just like I've got a family I've got you know everything that I need I don't need to be causing them sort of issues for myself and not only that but I can destroy you from here I don't need to go and do anything you know illegally or anything like that I can just make videos about your behavior and I just take you apart bit by bit yeah and that's all I do you say I'm angry all the time you're always angry I'm not I've just been angry with you and your behavior and what you've done yeah so your little tricks don't work. Like I say, if you want to come in and talk, come in and talk and have a conversation. And as long as you're not swearing and you're being, you know, really abusive in the chat, then you can come in and have a talk, a conversation with me. I trusted you a little bit more. I'd even stick it on the stream yard, but I don't think I trust you enough, and I don't think you trust me enough to have that sort of conversation on the stream yard. But I think that was would probably. I don't know, it might solve things because at least we could both get it off our um, shoulders, yeah. wouldn't it really? But again, I, I know that that's risky from the channel's point of view and you know that's risky from your channel's point of view as well. So, yeah, don't know about that one. But yeah, we're going to go on about the live stream now. So yeah, I hope people obviously do understand why we've done what we've had to do but you know what I mean for the integrity the safety of the channel and to just keep these little ones like you know a little bit shielded away from this shit it's not really for them is it you know what I mean it's not really for them I appreciate they are really trying to do what they can do and they you know fair play to some of them you know they are really really sort of dedicated aren't they to what they're doing so yeah. fair, fair play to you but um, don't get yourselves in trouble out there, people. Young uns, don't get yourself in trouble. It's not worth going um, to prison or getting anything on your records for this piece of shit, right? So I will say that to you. Just think about what you're doing. It ain't worth it. And you know what I'm saying? You give people enough rope, they'll hang themselves, mate. And he, he will do that. He'll hang himself. He will. Not literally, but... You know what I'm saying? It's a, it's a saying, isn't it? Yeah. He's going to do the damage himself without any of you doing it. Trust me. So be careful like that, people, because like I say, it's not worth... He isn't worth you getting in trouble, right? He ain't, he ain't worth it. And he'll do it to himself, so just sit back and watch, yeah? He'll say something to the wrong child one day and that child will go back to their parents. If they haven't already, I've heard that, yeah... <laughs> There is cases already, isn't there? <coughs> so, <clears throat> he's on borrowed time, 100%. And you know what I'm saying? It's just a matter of time now before he um, he gets sort of pulled up by what he's done. Like I say, there's a million things that he's done and he's still doing stuff. 
So something's going to stick, something's going to stick. And then obviously he's had his dispute with me, you know. So, I mean, obviously his channel's not in a good position now compared to my channel. I'm in a stronger position and he knows that. Yeah, he's taken my TikTok. And yeah, I am really pissed off about that. I will, will, will admit that I am pissed off about it, but what can I do about it? Nothing, yeah? But what it has highlighted to me is um, TikTok's broken. Because if somebody can go in there legitimately and make videos and then some scallywags like you can have a disagreement and just come in with your, your fake troll accounts and uh, mass reporting and all that to take the account down, which is what you've done, yeah? Um, I don't want to be part of it. Why would I want to be risky? Why would I want to put all my hard work in? Because I do proper videos, not like your crap. I do proper videos. Why would I want to put all my hard work onto a website which doesn't give me any support? YouTube gives me all the support I need. So I've been speaking to you know, customer support, system support, pretty much every day about the situation, as I'm sure you are aware, because the emails go in back and forth between, you know what I mean, third parties, etc. So. You know, but they've been fantastic. I've got to say, loads of support, and I will never leave YouTube. I'll stay here, I'll stay here forever. I'm the king. I'm the king, king of YouTube. But as far as TikTok, you lot can have that. I ain't interested in it. It's rubbish. What you've done is you've done me a favour. Because instead of me dividing my time between the two platforms, which was blowing my head to be honest with you, wasn't it? Yeah. It was just too much. It was doing too much between two platforms. Um, it, I've taken, you know, the eye off. The ball on on YouTube so you've actually done me a massive favor because now I can just concentrate on YouTube and I'll put all my efforts into what I'm doing at the minute yeah so you've really 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 helped me I didn't think so at first and I was really annoyed but you know past couple of days have been a lot easier I've been able to get a lot more sort of done and um, yeah that's what's important at the end of the day not not TikTok where you know what I'm saying somebody like you could just go in and go right then let's let's get all our friends and thing is just to say he's a wrong one and whatever do you know what I mean control drugs that's what you said that's how you have me taken down control drugs yeah there's nothing on that account with control drugs in it so well nothing labeled as control drugs anyway we did have the cake on there didn't we but that wasn't labeled as a no so <coughs> yeah, naughty, naughty. So the insults end. So we're gonna get back to that stream because we've both watched the stream now, haven't we? Yeah. Ninja, what do you think? I think you're utterly pathetic, to be honest. You need to come up with some different material to call me because everything you've called me, I've not heard before. So, you know. We've all been bullied in our lives, all of us. Yeah, our kids have been bullied because maybe they've been a little bit overweight. Um, you know, so we've we've had to deal with all of it. To be fair, we've had to do, deal with all of it. So it doesn't really doesn't really affect us. We've had it all. Yeah, the kids have had it all. We've taught them how to deal with it as well. As good parents do. So, do you know what I mean? Nothing. It was pathetic. It was a pathetic attempt. Not in that. <clears throat> what I will point out is, um, you, you don't attack me like you attack. Um, like weaker people, she's not weak by the way, but like what you perceive in your perception as a weaker person, you'll try and go for that target, which is why you target family members by trying to clone them, um, dead family members by trying to clone them, you know, it's really, really bullying tactics and it's really, really sad. Fem fresh on aisle 13, get some fem fresh for Ninja. Pathetic. I nicked that from Lord J. Cheers, Lord J. Subscribe to Lord J, people. He's a legend. Can I nick it? Can I just want to use it again, Lord J? Just give me. Pathetic. Cheers, mate. You can have that one back now. <laughs> it's good, though. I like it. <coughs> yeah. That sort of stuff, the kind of, the last time I sort of um, doubt with stuff like that it was obviously with my kids but other than that with me was when I was in the playground and not even sort of in the senior years in the younger years I'm talking from probably about 8 to probably 12 you would have those sort of conversations which is probably the sort of the age group funny enough that you're really into isn't it yeah 
Yeah. Seen that video when you were talking about your ideal uh, age and you was whispering it, weren't you? You dirty little bastard, didn't you? Dirty. So yeah, she wasn't bothered by it. And I know there was a lot of people in there trolling and trying to sort of, do you know what I mean, pump it up a little bit from your side. Yeah, and we've seen it, we've, we've gone through it all now. We know who is who, and we know who is doing what. Yeah. And we've had a lot of people analysing just all the chats and the different things, and we know, we know who's in. Nobody's going to be getting any more spanners. There may be spanners removed as well, so please don't be offended if you come back on and you don't have a spanner. It's for the safety and the security of the channel, and not yet. I think there's probably too many mods on there anyway, so we need to make sure that obviously the moderators are just doing the moderator's jobs, not just, you know, there for it having a spanner's sake you know a mod job is a mod job at the end of the day and um, it needs to be done properly and the mods we've got our older mods are spot on yeah you know and without them a lot of what we're doing now we wouldn't be doing yeah it's because we listen to people when they talk to us yeah it's all a learning curve still but it's all about getting it right for the integrity of the channel but names, stick, sticks and stones may break our bones. I was actually laughing. She was. I was laughing. She was. But it was absolutely I was in the front hilarious. room and she was in the bedroom and she was like having a fit and I come in just to see what like what you're laughing at and she's like, I'd, she was watching you. She was watching you, big boy. Did you like that video of me in the dress? Yeah? But took, that turns you right on. Took me ages to dig that out, yeah? I hope you like it. I hope you like it close as you'll get to me, with a dress on. <laughs> but I did think it was like, it was immature, and it was immature at picking at her, because you know, you call me Baldy and whatever, and then you move on to her for about an hour then, do you know what I mean? And, and like, you've done that in the past as well. Like I say, it's just bully tactics, it's bully, you know, you can't get to me, so you'll pick on a defenseless female who ain't really got anything to do with it. You know what I mean? Again, if people are watching and they think that's that's all right to do that, yeah, then what sort of people are you? You're scumbags at the end yeah. of the day. You're all scumbags. If you think that that's right, you're scum. You're nothing, yeah? Imagine that being your partner or your mother or somebody that they're taking the piss out of like that, yeah? Put yourself in that position, because I bet you don't, yeah? And you think that's funny, do you, yeah? Well, it might be, it might be funny to you, but wait till that happens. Wait till it happens back, yeah? And then let's see how you feel out there, yeah? That's how you feel when you're being bullied by people like this. Might start saying stuff about your cat, Sammy. Do you know what I mean? What, what a shame that would be, wouldn't it? Don't say I'd it. I'd upset you, because I can say some pretty nasty things about your cat, boy. Exactly. And we've said stuff about you, and we've kept it to you. I've not really, do you know what I mean? We've gone about on about the associates because they've trolled, and they know they've trolled, and they are just as bad as you. They're part of the goblin ring, obviously, and they'll be dealt with the same, yeah? Do you know what I'm saying? You're just, you're just completely wrong, mate. You're completely wrong. You've just got no morals. You've got no respect. You've got no code, yeah? You've got no code about you. Uh, a decent person with, you know, because you say you're, you're a decent guy in that, and it's me and this, that, and the other. A decent guy would not have done what you've done. They certainly wouldn't have um, picked on a defence as female, right? Who's got nothing to do with it, yeah? I certainly wouldn't have, do you know what I mean? Gone through somebody's accounts, got a picture of a dead relative and then made an account in their name. That's freaking sick, mate. That's sick. Yeah, and again, if people out there think that's funny, imagine that being happening to you, yeah? This guy, is. that's what he does. He's sick. And if you support him, you are sick. And you deserve just as much sort of whatever bad karma that he's got coming, you deserve it as well. Yeah, and I hope you all get it. All you lot out there who've supported this guy and stu stood up for him, yeah, when you know exactly what he's like and what he's been doing, you're just as bad as what he is, and it's just you're gonna come to the same demise, yeah? Because this sort of behavior is not acceptable, yeah? It's not acceptable, yeah? Not only that, but a lot of this sort of behavior usually is 
pretty underground, isn't it? You don't kind of hear of it and see of it. He's publicly doing this stuff, right? How the hell do you think you're going to get away with what you're doing? Yeah? When normally the wrong ones go underground and try and, you know, join all these cults and all them sick sort of fucking things that, you know, Jimmy Savile and all that business and, you know, the Prince Andrew and bloody Epstein and all of that shit. Black books and, you know what I mean? Yeah. What do you think, Ninja? I don't think a lot about him at all, really. He's nothing. So... If you're gonna pick on someone, pick on me. If you're gonna insult somebody, insult me, yeah? Right? Because I'm the one who's got the problem with you, not anyone else. They haven't really got a problem with she has now. <laughs> she has now. I had when you started bringing my family into it. Yeah. Yeah, when you started taking pictures of my kids and stuff. Then that's when I got involved. Up to that point, I said jack and fucking shit about you, mate. Jack and shit. Call me a fishy fanny. Look at your fucking blue steel and cheese of a knob. I bet there's mould upon mould upon mould on that tiny little chipolata sausage of yours. No wonder you can't get a man or a woman, you fucking fat huffer. Yeah, exactly. Can't even see his penis. Can't Will see his feet. speak to those boys on camera? saying you want to rim them and sit on their face and stick your finger up their ass. Are you absolutely disgusting? Seriously? And you think that's acceptable to talk to a young child that way and get off on it and go, oh yeah, oh yeah, you're filth, mate. I want you're you to be my first. Filth. I want you to be my first. You sick. Like I say, it's all like that. all out there. You don't even have to search because it's there. It's just there, isn't it? It's there. Not even that. It's like, it's there multiply. Loads of people have got there. Do you know what I mean? So, you're done, mate. You're finished. You're gone. You're finished. It's only a matter of time. The eyes are all over you. Like you said, you might as well just stop now. Leave us alone. Stop sort of trolling us. By all means, carry on making the videos. This is YouTube. I don't expect you not to do that, yeah? Yeah, and that's all I'm going to do. I'm not going to do anything else. I'm just going to make videos about you. Do you know what I mean? And deal with you accordingly if you step out of line. I'm going to do it the correct way. I've said this from day one. I'm not going to troll you. I'm not going to go into your chats and pretend to be people and have two, three, four, five multiple people in there, yeah? I'm not going to go there and donate and try and, you know, lure you into a sense, uh, false sense of security, you know. And I know it was you donating because you're like that. You made that video when you're going, oh, look at you when you, um, look at you when you get your donations. You go like, woo, yeah, yeah. And I do because I'm not used to it. And I'm really thankful that somebody's like donated. So yeah, I do go, woo, yeah. And I have a little bit of a dance in that, you know, because I'm not used to it. But I know half of it has come from you now. Yeah, I realise that it's you there trying to get me you to know, watch it, trying to affect me through the stream. Yeah, it's, it's control. That's what it is. You're trying to control my stream by doing these things. Yeah, and that's the only way you can get control is by coming in and putting fake donations in and shit. So I'm not stupid, mate. I'm not stupid. Right? It's control. The only one who's getting anything out of that is you, because you just think that you're still you're in there. You're not, but you're not. You're not, because we've seen through it, yeah? We've seen through it. One or two people have donated to us in the past, but it's just, we're not used to having, you know, we do get little bits every now and again, but... But we don't do it for that. No, we Never don't, we that. don't. We're thankful, but we don't do it. We, like you, many, 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 let's just have as much. Give me, give me, give me. I've got to end the stream because nobody's donating or the analytics are crap. Don't matter. All, all your mods have gone asleep. I've got, I got, five, I got five people on my stream. I still, I still entertain them. I won't go, oh, fuck you five people, yeah? You're not enough. No, I'll be fucking out, thanks. Thanks for five people being there and taking your time to watch and spend your time with me, yeah? I'm thankful for that, right? So don't take the piss out of that, right? Yeah, because the people I've got coming over are genuine until you start attending your trolls. And the other thing that was highlighted last night was the fact that, do you know what I mean? There was no trolls or anything a lot of the people you had in the other streams were young people this is why i say you groom 
youngsters to do things for you, right? So as soon as we put that restriction on, all those people who were in there, do you know what I mean? You got to do the work for you by grooming them, they'd all disappeared. And that's why we didn't have much of an issue on the stream. It was calm, it was, you know, and like I say, I know there was still a couple of you in there, right? But there wasn't half as many of you in there as there was the stream before. And it showed in the disruption from the stream before. See, I don't do that to you as a creator. That's wrong, yeah? That's wrong. All I've done is pointed out things in my video which aren't really right about you, and I've got every right to do that, but you have no right to come in and try and affect my family. Again, take people's profile pictures, children, dead relatives, kids' pictures. That's a dodgy one, isn't it, that one? Taking children's pictures and using them to troll people. You go prison for that one, definitely. 100%. And they've got that. Trust me, the mum is not happy, right? You're going to come unstuck because you're going to come against, you're going to come up against people like us who just won't stop. You push that button, <clears throat> you put our kids in front of us and other people and whatever. You know, in a way to troll us. You're going to come unstuck with that one especially. I tell you that now, you ain't going to get away with that. You ain't going to get away with that. So just stop your behaviour. Yeah. Make your videos. Carry on. Call me whatever you want. I don't care. She don't care. Yeah. All right. We've called you, eh? We've called you names. You called us names back. Tip for tap. Yeah. Like you say, I can't expect any difference. And if I do, I should be making these videos, should I? And she knows that as well, right? Not bothered, mate, carry on, carry on. But what you don't do is do it the wrong way, right? Stop your trolling, stop your fake donations and your fake people in the channels, just fuck off. Just fuck off, away from our channel, right? Because if you want me to start, then that'll be different. Right? At the minute, I haven't started. I've just made pissing videos about you. I haven't started yet, really. So, be warned, yeah? Because whatever you do, I can do as well. I just don't want to. I don't want to lower myself to it. I started off not insulting you, not calling you any names or anything. I just made an absolutely honest review, which was really, really, really fair. It was really, really fair. I didn't really go to town on you. I could have got in a lot, a lot harder, a lot harder, yeah? You've turned this into what this is. Yeah, not me. I'm not the clout chaser. You're the clout chaser because your figures are fucking going down. People aren't watching you. People are desubscribing from your channel. Not a huge amount, but you're not going up, right? You're going down. You're going backwards now, and you know you're going backwards. And that's the first sign of the decline. Yeah? Because you're horrible to people. Yeah? And the fact that you haven't got the balls to keep your, your, your videos up, you have to delete them. What? Wow, what I'm a saying, pussy. I've got a we fake. don't take our, our, no. our videos down, no. but you take yours down. Only the racist one, where he sent his uh, crew in. I said there was a gaming stream I took down, which was 59 minutes. It's the only one I took down. But again, because that could have taken the channel down, and he knows that, which is why he's doing that. Again, which is why he's trying to troll me in children's accounts. Yeah. Yeah? So, but you're the one, mate. You're the one accountable for that. And all those accounts, all those accounts will get banged, yeah? No matter what technology you've got, you're gonna get banged out. There will be a trail back to you and your mates, so. Peace will love people out there. Don't worry about people like this in life. They literally, they'll come and start quick enough. He's done everything now. It's a matter of time. I keep checking his account on a daily basis to see if he's there, because I think that it is going to get taken any minute. And it's going to go like that. It will go like that, it will. He certainly doesn't stream as much as he has been. He can't, because he can't help himself. He can't construct, you know, he's got to go into threatening mode straight away. And you know what I mean? At that point, he, you know what I mean? He's lost it. And from a legal point of view, he has to then, remove that stream because yeah. he's get he's gone he ain't just tit for tat like having a little bit of a bitch and a moan he's actually going into sort of detail and yeah. do you know what I mean and you can't do that 
a trail wheel lead back to you, you will get somebody to do something for you, or you might have already got somebody to do something for you, and that will be your downfall, right? Because when somebody's backed into a corner, they won't back you, right? When somebody gets a tap on the shoulder, you know, Bill, and they've got to explain their actions, what do you think they're going to say about you, matey boy? You fucked. You're going to be the biggest scapegoat in the world, yeah? You're going to be literally... They're not going to care for you, like you don't care for them. Finished, bro. You're finished. You're finished. But you're sick stuff. Stop it. I'm telling you now. I'm telling you now. You need to stop it now. Yeah. Because if it continues, there will be trouble. Yeah. There will be consequences. And again, legal consequences and things being done the correct way. I don't threaten. I don't need to threaten. I never threaten. It just doesn't need to be done. It doesn't need to be done. The fact is, you ain't going to meet me. Yeah? Ever. You'd never come close to coming up to meet me. You wouldn't. He's already said he wouldn't waste the petrol. He wouldn't. He wouldn't come up. Because he knows what would happen. I would literally, at that stage, if I was faced with him, I would tell you right now, I would be going to prison. Right? 100%. I would be going to prison. And I'll tell you what, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> and she'll tell you that as well. If I've got to do a little bit in the neck, do you know what I'm saying? To protect myself. And he knows that, and he knows that. He turned up like he did at Jeremy's. How many times, you know what I mean? Taking his cat treats, you sick fuck. You sick, mate. Intimidating, you're a bully. Turning up at a bloke's house like nine times with two goons, two big blokes. Yeah, and you're too fat to even get out of the car. Not even that, but you don't want to impl implicate yourself that that's why you get these dickheads, these goons to do it for you. Because they're that thick, they can't see that they're going to be the ones more in trouble than probably what he is if he sat in the back of the car and they're knocking on someone's door, intimidating someone. They're going to get done by the old bill, not the guy sat in the back of the car. Yeah? He's fucking using you, you cunts. He's using you completely and you can't even fucking see it. Fucking idiots. What are you gonna do when this um when this this guy sort of drinks himself to death or he has a heart attack? What are you gonna do then? You know what I mean? Because again, not being nasty, being realistic is his health is terrible, his diet is terrible. I've never seen somebody drink um, bottles of vodka like bottles of wine. I've never seen that like that. And I have been around some alcoholics, you know, I've had alcoholics in a family, etc. And um, I have never, ever, ever seen anyone drink that amount of vodka. So I don't think you're going to be here very long. What are all you lot, all you cronies, and all you lot who are sort of loyal to him, what are you going to do then? <laughs> You'd be all like little lost sheep and yeah. Pied Piper, do you know what I mean? The Pied Piper's died. All you rats, you're gonna die with him. And yeah, that's what happened to the rats, isn't it? They got drowned, didn't they? Pied Piper, what did he do? He got the, took them all around the, out the city, innit? I can't remember, wasn't it? He took them into the river, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah, man, Pied Piper. Look at that, trust me, that's what's gonna happen. You'll all be going down. So he won't be around to answer for any of this because he just he'll be six foot under. Do you know what I'm saying? Because of his health. And um, all you lot out there who have supported him, you're going to be left with the police looking at you and investigating you because this stuff is going to go on for a long time. It ain't just going to go away. This stuff's going to go on now, right? And you think if he passes away, you think it stops with you lot? <laughs> if you've been involved in dealing with children's images and things like that. You fucks. Yeah? You haven't thought about that, have you? No, you haven't. Do you not think about that when you're taking a child's image and putting it onto... Because um, that'll still be on your uh, your laptops or your phones or wherever matter. you Always took there. it from. Always still there. Be there. GCHQ are tracking. It. We're right by still GCHQ out. here, mate. So, there you go. Nothing ever gets erased. It's there in the clouds. Which again, which is why we don't do anything 
like dodgy, which is why we're absolutely, we're mustard, because it ain't worth it. It isn't worth doing anything not right. You've got to be 100% legitimate when you're running a channel. You have to, because eventually, if you're not, somebody out there will find something and they'll close you down. So you've got to be squeaky, squeaky clean. You've got to be squeaky clean, yeah? You're not, you're not squeaky clean. You can't even wash yourself. You can't even dry yourself. You say, my missus stinks. I bet you fucking stink foul, mate. Yeah? And again, I'm not being horrible. That is a fact. And the reason why you've said that, you know, to Ninja, is because the truth is, it's a self-reflection on yourself. It's you that actually smells, isn't it? Right? It's you who has to actually buy the Femme Fresh. Femme Fresh! Femme Fresh! Femme Fresh for Ian, Ian, uh, aisle nine please, Ian, Femme Fresh. So let's be honest, that's where you've got that experience from, isn't it? Yeah, you actually use it for your cheesy knob, like my missus has just said, yeah? Yeah, we know now, we know, self-reflection, it's easy, because of the detail you put into it, so we know that that's your experience for yourself, yeah? And which is probably why we're laughing, because we're imagining you, at the end of the aisle, asking for the Femme Fresh for yourself, do you know what I mean? Because of your cheesy, your cheesy knob, do you know what I mean? Oh dear. It's probably all that Domino's, do you know what I mean? Dropped a bit, whoops! Babe, cheese strings. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, you want to get foul, you want to get nasty, you want to get vulgar, yeah. We can do it all day long. And we love it. We love it. We love it. Cheesy knob, mate. What's that touching my foot? It's the cheese strings from me knob. <laughs> <laughs> winner, winner. King's dinner. Dirty bastard. Yeah. So, yeah. Self-reflection there. Self-reflection on yourself. Yeah. So I can get out of my house and take a walk. And the reason why I know that is because on your back of your dirty, scummy wall, you've got an uh, air freshener and you've got two cans of fucking spray. So you've obviously got a fucking problem. <laughs> Did you see that shot? So there you go, mate. Watch what you say, because at the end of the day, if it's a reflection on yourself, it's always just going to get turned back, all right? Do yourself a favour, pick on me and only me, yeah? And then people will find it funny and they'll probably watch your videos and stuff like that, but you start picking on defenseless women and, you know what I mean, and bringing up dead relatives and things like that. It doesn't matter who you think supports you, there's gonna be a lot of people who look at that and think, fucking hell, mate, that's a little bit too much. That's a little bit going a little bit over the top from a YouTube sort of roasting sort of channels, roasting each other. It's going a little bit far then, isn't it, really? You know what I mean? And then it doesn't, it's not funny then. It isn't funny. The only people who find that funny is the sickos. The real sickos out there. Do you know what I mean? And you're welcome to have them. Because I don't want them on my channel. Fucking hell. Don't want them. We only want nice people. Yeah. Positive, peace, one laugh, good vibe, good energy. That's us. Yeah. But yeah, we're not putting these on premieres either. Again, just to stop the amount of. Um, of young people coming in really isn't it so and then obviously the uh, the lives will be restricted so nobody can come in then over 18 but other than that watch what you're saying yeah young man i'll call you young man because you're a lot younger than me so watch what you're saying right pick on somebody your own size if you can find someone <laughs> yeah but like i say if someone's having a go at you have a dispute with them right have a dispute with them don't go and pick on somebody else because that's just pathetic and you know like you're just destroying yourself, mate. You're destroying your credibility. You know, you say that, you know, you don't care that people don't like you, but do you know what I mean? That, people are going to hate you. They're going to hate you even more, and that's why you're going backwards at the minute. But other than that, peace and love to all my subscribers. Look out for the Halloween treats coming really, really soon because I'm just uploading some stuff, and we're going out to do some filming uh, over the next couple of days, 100%. So see you soon, people. One love. Cheers.